back and welcome back again. So we're here with brother-in-law Hank again. Hey everybody. So we're gonna continue with Ladies Night. Yeah, yeah, the theme of the night was Ladies Night, Ladies Who Rock. Yeah. Ladies, uh, in, in my mind, great rockers mm -hmm. I've, who I've seen. I've seen Hard a couple of times. I saw Pat Benatar that we did earlier. Uh, we're now gonna do The Pretenders. Chrissy Hine, the first lady of punk, new wave, I guess you can say, early, late 70s, early 80s rock. I mean, this lady did it all. Fantastic. I saw them, I think, three times, and every time they were just so freaking good. So, one of my favorite also lady rockers of all time. I know there's a lot, and I know, but to me, Chrissy Hine, uh, you know. It's up there. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. So, um, we're gonna go back to the show Fridays mm -hmm. because I've show, had some great, great musical artists of that day, and um, the song we're gonna do is a song called "Message of Love," which was from their second uh, second album. So I don't know if you've heard it. You've, you've heard of the Pretenders. You've I've heard, heard of the Pretenders. Chrissy yeah. Hine, mm -hmm. you, you've heard of them. Yeah, I think I know a couple of their songs. You probably know "I'll Stand by You," which is a very yeah. you know brass mm -hmm. and pocket. I'm sure you don't know yeah. by name, but yeah. brass and pocket, you, you've heard. But even then, there's other stuff that you know, you, if you heard it, oh yeah, yeah, I know that song. Yeah. They had a lot, a lot of stuff. Right. But to me, I always like the the earlier, the rocker stuff. Right. Like I always say, you know, the, the yeah. more of the rocker side. And this is one of the, but this was also a very popular song, but also a little bit on the rocker side, so. I don't know if I know this song. I mean, yeah. the title, I don't know. The, you know. It got played a lot, but well, yeah. it was in rock yeah. stations and you were not listening to rock stations back in those days. You know, she's she helped on the rock and roll train late in life, but better late than never, as they always say. So, um, so we'll, we'll forgive her for that. Huh? We'll get you into disco. Next <laughs> <time>. <laughs> <laughs> All I can do is train. salute right. everybody. <laughs> I don't know about that. I, you know, if I haven't done it in 50 I years, I doubt it. Know. In my next 50 years, I don't, I don't think so. <laughs> salute. All right. You ready? Yep. Let's do this. Go. Here are the pretenders. Yeah. Have you heard it? Nope. No? Okay, yeah. Never yeah. heard it. And this is the first time I'm seeing them. I don't even know what they look like. The Pretenders, yeah. Nope. Yeah. This, they came out in 79, I believe. 77, yeah. 79 was the first album. This was the second album. Um, yeah, but yeah, you never seen Chrissy Hine either? No. Okay. I don't know what she looks like. And the funny thing is, if you saw her today, I mean, obviously she's older, but she looks pretty much the same. Really? Same build. She, you know, and, uh, she gave up drinking and drugs and alcohol, you know, all that stuff uh -huh. about 10 years ago. 
she went vegan, she does yoga, so she's very healthy. And I saw her not too long ago, I think it was in an interview, and I mean, she looks fantastic. You know, of course, you can tell she's aged, you know, she's like, I think 68, 69 or something like that. But she looks fantastic. She almost like what she did. What did she have any work done? I don't think so. No, no, she's a very natural, very natural girl. As a matter of fact, in the 80s, when, when MTV came along and they were, everybody was getting, and we talked about earlier with Hart, how they all got fixed mm -hmm. up for the she was totally against it. She says, no, man, this is me and this is what it is. And, mm. and that's that. So she's totally against all that getting fixed mm. and all that. That's, she's just yeah, natural. Well, not for everybody. Yeah. So not for me neither. So you never heard, but see this a nice sort of punk new wave. You know, punk was big in the 70s. Uh -huh. And then in the 80s, it sort of morphed into what they you know, called, I guess, alternative or, or new wave music, which was bands like The Pretenders and mm. uh, Talking Heads and Blondie and the bands like that that you might have heard, but um, no, they were one of the one of the great bands of, of that era. So, okay. let's get So, this is interesting. I've never seen them before. First okay. Time. All right, let's, let's, let's do this. <laughs> She's I mean, got so much music, music, so much material. She has a lot of good music, though. Yeah, I, mean, I know some of her songs. Yeah, yeah. I mean, you can I'm do, like, you can do wow, some of the other. Uh, I just never seen them before. I mean, it's like I didn't even know she played the guitar. Yeah, no, she's, she 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 cool. writes the music. She likes lyrics. She plays guitar. I mean, she's a complete cool. rock rock. I guess wow. back in the day you would say a rock chick, you know, a total rock and roller. I mean, she's a complete musician. Um, you know, she she's done a lot of things. With other bands, she did uh, with UB40 that uh, Sunny and Cher, I Got You Babe. That was a very big hit in, yeah. I guess, the 80s, early 90s, I'm guessing. Uh, another one, Breakfast in Bed, with, with UB40 also was a very big and hit. And I saw UB40. Yeah, like, you did, that's right, that's right. I mean, I saw I UB40 also. I songs too, but it got blocked. Yeah, probably Red, 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 Red Wine. Wine. Yeah, that's. Mm -hmm. uh, got blocked. You know, I saw UB40 also in New yeah. York at the pier mm -hmm. on. Uh, was 44th Street, I guess, also early 80s. Um, no, that was a good show, actually. But yeah, no, she, so she's collaborated with a lot of, she spoke, she sang back up on Pride in the Name of Love by U2. I think we spoke oh, about it at the time when we, when we did, just for that song, when we did that Pride a few months ago, I think we mentioned it at the time, but so she's done you know, a lot Wait, of things. Wait, is she with, American? She was born in, uh, in Ohio, Akron, Ohio, oh, and she moved, okay. but, but she moved to England. I guess when she was young, and then she so she's, and I think I could be wrong, but I think she might have given up her U.S. citizenship and became a British citizen. I think I, I, okay. I remember hearing something like that, but I know she. So right now, is she still in the, in the uh, UK? Or? I think so. I mean, yeah. I mean, yeah. yeah she's, so she I think so. She stays there. And... Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, she's got a song called "I Went Back to Ohio, but my city was gone." You know, that she wrote obviously after, but uh, she's got some really, really. Uh, some some really good She's good stuff, though. yeah. So you know you can probably do um, "I'll Stand by You," it's a song that 
got played on the radio, you you would know that a lot. You know, with me, I like more the deep cuts or the the rocker stuff, so you can do that. Yeah, you like a lot of songs that, that <laughs> don't get played in the radio. I know, I know, but it's great music, though. This is great music. It's great right? music that nobody ever heard of. I mean, it's nice to introduce them to music that nobody ever heard of. Yeah. Right. I mean, th this was played on the radio. This is not. You know, a deep cut not is... Not my radio station. No, of course, of course. And we're not playing it with the village people <laughs> and, and Gloria Gaynor What's and wrong Donna with Summer. the village people? No, absolutely nothing. Abs but this, this music was not being played in that same station. And you were listening <laughs> to that. No, absolutely nothing against all of that. I mean... Okay. But that, this is not what you were listening to. Pat Benatar was not being played on, on those stations. Well, they were, because I know some Pat Benatar songs. Yeah, but... Maybe love is a battlefield because it's yeah. more pop, it's more mainstream. I do okay. listen to not only disco, I listen to pop, <laughs> pop rock. Yes, yes. It's just an, up until recently you got into rock or yeah. Now stuff. it's getting yeah. The real yeah, good But I know stuff. like the pop rock and stuff. And I'm glad for Queen because Queen opened the door for you to into I a love different Queen. world. Oh my God, I'm sorry. You know, they opened the door into the world of nobody rock. Nobody compared to my Queen. No. But there's so much more than Queen. Queen opened yes. the door, you came yes. in, and then you saw, wow, look at this. Which, look at this and rabbit hole. And they opened the in. door, and then it's very hard to. Right, I get it. You know 100%. What I mean? But you got Zeppelin, like, you got oh uh, you know, Floyd, you got Yes, you no, got. No, I mean, I like them you know, all. I mean, you yeah, know, but you my two. number one. So no, that's perfectly fine. No, no, that's like you perfect. have your number right, one. Right, agreed. Oh. And that's perfectly fine. I'm just, so bad, right? I'm just glad that because of no, Queen also now you're yeah. open to other stuff, yeah. which before you weren't. So. Yeah. yeah. We grew up, we've known each other 45, 46 years, and she was <laughs> never into our part, our group, you know, no. her sisters and my brothers, and no. you know, always hung out, and she was never into <laughs> our stuff, so you know, so. Like in my own So 45 years later, she's... people. <laughs> <laughs> took her 45 oh years to come into, the, into, into our I side. Know. To leave the dark side. Oh <laughs> That's too funny. But you're welcome. The rock world welcomes you with open arms. Absolutely. Agree. Absolutely. Never stop learning. Now that I'm older, I'm probably gonna forget. <laughs> what I listen to. You're older, but at least you're wiser, obviously, because you're getting into some good stuff. I'm so. Wiser, but I'm very forgetful. <laughs> That's why she makes the video so she can go back and remember the next day. <laughs> Somebody has a birthday coming up this weekend, so uh, you're going to be 60. 59 for the third or fourth time. 50. So you're already forgetting. <laughs> I already told you forgetting. it's going to be 59. <laughs> Wait, this year, they say this year doesn't count. Yeah, I know. This, this year, year it's like... You already said. Forget it. No, you're I'm, right. I'm you're right. celebrating yeah. my birthday. I've, I've never turned 22. Mm. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Yeah. yeah. It's 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 very hard. You just want to forget this year. Yeah, never you know, it's, it's funny because as bad as this year has been, for some people, it's flying by. For me, it's flying it by. Is. But for other people, it's just dragging and it's, it's never September ending. September already. Right. But there, I was watching something. Oh uh, my god. On TV earlier today, and they were saying how the same exact year means different things for different people. Like for me, it's yes. flown. I mean, like you said, Mine I can't believe it's already September. Like but they also were saying to a lot of people that, oh, this is just dragging on, it and is, you know, I is. can't believe it's only yeah. September, and yeah. how long we're going to have to put, you know. I know. The stress level out yeah. there is like way it's up. a lot of stress out Absolutely. there. Absolutely. Either way, whether you're going yeah. to go fast or slow, it's still a lot, right. of, a lot of stress. You right. Know, a lot of people. I mean, like. So that's what we're trying to do bring a little relief, a little laughter, a little silliness, you know, in this yes. time. Just enjoy life. You know, yeah. Right. I mean, you hopefully know. Hopefully, everybody's doing okay out there and mm -hmm. gotta enjoy a little bit you know and my pretenders Pat Dennis our queen you know uh, who are so hard I mean these are bands that yeah. bring a little joy into your life and that's the idea so and you guys you know absolutely like, I mean yeah. it's a lot you know I mean it brings us a lot of um, joy yeah, yeah. And joy. Also, joy. yeah. <laughs> I mean, that's what See we how I that's what that's what we're doing this <laughs> Please leave your comments, you know, good, yes, bad, or indifferent, please. you know, just yeah, leave, your leave something up there. We don't have no friends. <laughs> Speak for yourself. <laughs> okay, I don't have Speak no friends. <laughs> You're my only uh, friend. Just try. 
But yet the dogs hate me, so how do you figure, you know? Oh, yeah, you don't know. <laughs> uh, Alright, anyway. guys, so make sure you guys stay safe. Yeah. And of course, leave your comment mm -hmm. below and subscribe. like, subscribe, and you oh. share the video if you want to, you know? And Absolutely. Yeah. Share yeah. the joy with everybody. <laughs> Alright, everybody. See you next time. Let's I hope you enjoy the. I fall asleep. I hope you enjoy the the ladies' night theme. You know, I like three it. great mm -hmm. lady rocker bands. I yes. mean, to me, all three I like of them. Ladies. I like. I mean, when they they're so powerful, like all these ladies, you know. And they yeah, of course they're all they're rather awful. Girl power. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Janis Joplin. Of course, maybe we can do. I mean, she's you know died in 1970, but she's one of the ultimate rocker, the ultimate rocker chicks. Yeah. You know, she's incredible voice. And there's a few others, of course, you know, so there's just a lot, but these were three of mine, you know, yeah. from my, when I was right. listening to music as a kid, you know, in the late 70s, early 80s, so that's why I chose those three, and two of them are in the Hall of Fame, and now the third one, Pat, should be in it, hopefully next year. Yeah, she definitely so, should be in it. Yeah, no, ladies, ladies, ladies who rock rule, I mean, ladies they rule do. anyway, oh I think God. ladies rule of anyway. Of course we do. Absolutely, but ladies who rock... W O <laughs> the boss of you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody, before I get into any trouble, Bye. stay safe. We'll see you next time. <laughs> Be safe. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment again. Bye. Bye, everybody.